This is Coyote News. USD hosted a sold-out doubleheader on Saturday. Woman tipped off first against Oral Roberts and ended the game with five Coyotes in double digits. Freshman Maddie Cruel, freshman Morgan Hansen, sophomore Alexi Hemp, and senior Chloe Lamb were among the five. Senior Hannah Shervin also claimed double digits, making it her sixth 20-point game of the season. South Dakota shot 47.3% from the field and 45% for threes. USD walked off the court with a 77-54 score win. Both teams returned to the court the following day. The Coyotes' annual Pink Game Day raised awareness for breast cancer. Before tip-off, senior center Hannah Shervin was honored for surpassing 1,000 career points in her four years with the Coyotes. Shervin led the pink game with a double-double as she posted 18 points, 10 rebounds, and two blocks. Freshman guard Maddie Krull posted her fourth consecutive double-digit game with 14 points and a pair of steals. Chloe Lamb provided 12 points, followed by Alexia Hemp with nine. The Golden Eagles fell to the Coyotes in a final score of 76 to 54. The men's basketball team followed the women in play against Oral Roberts. On the court were the top four scorers in Summit League. For the Coyotes, Stanley Amude and AJ Plitzawhite. For the Golden Eagles, Kevin O'Borner and Max Obnis. Xavier Fuller played consistently throughout the game and ended with a career high 22 points. Fuller started the team off in a first minute and a half, putting the Yotes up 7 to 0. At one point, Oral Roberts tied the Coyotes 84 to 84 in the second half. But two good free throw shots by Plitza White put the Coyotes up by two with two seconds on the game clock. Obnis, the nation's second leading scorer, made one last three point shot from directly behind the arc, bouncing just off the rim and out. But it wasn't enough. The Yotes claimed an 86 to 84 victory. The men's Sunday game was canceled when USD announced a positive COVID-19 test from a staff member. The women's and men's basketball teams are returning to the SCSC this Saturday and Sunday for a doubleheader against North Dakota. The men are battling for first place in the Summit League.